Is HelloFresh worth the price? Absolutely. Hold on! Before you think that this is just like any other video promoting a cook at home meal for 10 quid, I want to tell you that this video is not sponsored so I will be 100% honest with you and will answer this question for you. Is it worth it? I mean like really? Is it that good? If you're new here, welcome! And of course, if you want to see more videos from London or travel related content, don't forget to hit the subscribe bell button down below. Hello, hello! Here we are with our first Hello Fresh delivery. Let's see what's in the box! On top are the recipes and each recipe has a number which corresponds to a bag with ingredients inside. I don't eat meat so that's why I chose the tofu rice bowl, the veggie black bean stir fry, the refried bean and halloumi tacos and the panzanella salad. There were actually plenty of veggie options so I'm definitely happy about that. Each recipe has a number so after that you have to look for this number to find the ingredients for this recipe. The first recipe that I decided to test it is the veggie packed black bean stir fry. As you can see the name doesn't lie, there are actually quite a lot of veggies. Some saucy sauce. Quite, quite generous on the veggies, I have to say. My only problem with this recipe is that now I realize that it's actually missing a protein. Well, yeah, hello fresh. You could have done a bit, you know, more chicken. No, I chose the veggie beans. Why? Okay, I have to be honest with you. For me, there was something wrong in this recipe because you cook the veggies just with a little bit of olive oil without like salt, pepper or absolutely anything until the moment when you put the sauce. Like, literally, any sort of flavor comes only from the sauce. First reaction. Well, let's try, let's give it a try, you know? It's a little fresh for the fries. We'll see. So many peanuts. I know, it doesn't look like a topping. It looks like a main A main, yes, a main. So saucy. Maybe I shouldn't have put it though. Another day, another recipe. We're going strong with the tacos tonight because it's Tuesday, so I thought it might be fun to do a taco Tuesday. And also because I think, let me just turn on the oven. This should be the best recipe or at least the one with the most foods. Here we have all the ingredients, the salad, the actual uh, tacos, the halloumi cheese, which is quite a lot, and it says made in Cyprus, so we really like that. Of course, our beans, tomatoes, quite a lot of mayo, lime, and garlic. Little observation. Whoever made these recipes, I don't think they were doing the dishes by hand because they require quite a lot of bowls, pans, trays, forks, and also not everyone has them in their homes. Look at this sizzling halloumi. We have so much food. Here are the beans. By the way, I added some extra tomato because I like it tomatoey. The mayo with lime. Three. Okay, six. Oh, this halloumi. Another salsa. And the salad. The salad looks a bit sad. Hello, hello. This looks amazing. So let's start with some uh, fresh lettuce. Starting with quite a lot of beans. Let's. One in the pan, one on the floor, one in the tank. Something else fell. <laughs> but this was just lettuce, so it, it's actually. It's fine. It's quite clean. Hello, guys! Are you ready for another dinner with Vasi? Today we are having a panzanella salad. How it is? supposed to look or in other words how it is not going to look because what I realized is that everything looks so nice on these photos but the reality it's not always as good looking so we have the rocket salad which Ben hates so I guess I have all this rocket salad for me butternut squash feta I mean this whole thing it's actually a hundred grams is taking 30, between 35 and 40 minutes and something which I like that I see in here is that it is three out of your five a day it's quite great so 
here all the veggies i'm just gonna add some oil salt and pepper and they're going directly into the oven it says to tear this into bite sizes but i mean what is what is really a bite size we actually have a different ciabatta but we ate it the day before so yeah i just bought some bread how cute are these Okay, this is the third recipe that I'm cooking and I have a couple of observations. The timing that it says, I think it's a, a little bit rough estimate, like in the sense that if you're reading and following really carefully the instructions and doing them one by one, it's gonna take you more time and it usually takes me like 10 minutes at least more because I make sure that I follow everything correctly. Taking my words back. The cheese is not actually not so much and this is usually the amount that you get for one greek salad when you're in greece the funny thing is that this is supposed to be the dressing so we have quite a chunky dressing but oh, oh, that's you know okay. overall it looks good and we also got some sushi because uh, i don't know i just want to make sure I'm, I'm well fed today okay i still cannot get over it it's so pretty look at all these colors hello Look at it! We have a little guest in here. By the way, yeah, I know I have to clean my windows. Today we have our final recipe, which is the spiced tofu sesame rice bowl. Am I excited about this recipe? Not really. Are we going to cook it anyways? Yes, definitely. Something which I quite like realize with uh, HelloFresh is that they give you a lot of sauces, but not so much like food, or at least not a lot of carbs. Like, this is all the rice that we got for two people. It is 150 grams. And let me tell you, that's not a lot. This huge pack with sauce. And here are all the ingredients. As you can see, the sauce is as much as the rice. I cannot do this anymore. I need to change the recipe. Hello, fresh. More substance, less sauces. So the thing is, uh, we have to pickle the carrots, but I'm putting them in the pan together with the beans prawns that, that we bought yesterday. For how much? We low veggies. We bought them for 32p. So I would say that's how pretty many, worth it. It's like 300 grams. 300 grams. Yeah. So we'll basically get more bean sprouts than rice. So that's gonna be fun. So the rice is ready. But oh my god, guys, this is not enough food. This is usually the portion for one person in our Which house. Portion? No, like for two people, there's no way. Like, what no. am I supposed to eat? It's funny because most of the veggies in here are the bean sprouts that they bought and not like the veggies that were included. This is the rice situation, so this is actually less than what Ben would usually have and I just put a little bit for me. Expectations versus reality. Okay? But you know what's even sadder? This portion. This time we have the sauces on the side, which I guess it's like totally wrong way of doing it. The main ingredient in our case are actually the bean sprouts that were not included. So, cheers to that. So the question is, is HelloFresh worth the price? No, fuck no. Uh, I mean, absolutely not. Um, 